Well, most of the rain today, as expected, was uh, to our south along the coast and mainly south of Interstate 10. In Mid County, you saw some decent rains earlier today and some over three inch rainfall totals down at Sabine Pass. Here's our time lapse camera from one of our cameras at North Beaumont around 105. You can see a few sprinkles in Beaumont today, not a whole lot. Like I said, from Interstate 10 North, we sure didn't see much rain today, but uh, quite a bit along the coastline as the front that came through a few days ago helped to trigger some of those showers and storms this morning. Your Friday night football four Forecast looking good. We're in the 80s now. We'll fall into the 70s throughout the game with no rain expected. And that weekend forecast looking good too. A 20% coverage of showers for your Saturday. We'll have high temperatures back into the uh, lower 90s. Same for Sunday up to 92. It's even hotter than that as we head into next week. In fact, here it is. It's your high temperature forecast beginning tomorrow on into next week up to the mid 90s. So summer returns next week with very little, if any, chance of rain. Right now we're in the mid 80s. Beautiful evening out there, mostly clear skies. Things have really stabilized and dried out uh, from this morning showers across the area. Now moisture levels this evening slowly dropping. They were a lot higher in this earlier. So we head into tomorrow. Notice those numbers still dropping. This precipital water or the total amount of moisture in the atmosphere. So it drops tomorrow compared to today, but still enough around for some scattered showers. Notice a lot drier off to our east in Louisiana. Those rain coverage is 20% tomorrow, only 10% Sunday, Monday. No rain at all expected next week, just hot and dry. Right now we're mostly clear with light southeasterly winds off the Gulf. Still a few showers off to the north of Houston. That's about it. A big winter today with southwest of Sabine Pass, almost three and a quarter inches of rain there. We're running in the mid 80s now, so pretty comfortable out there. Not a bad afternoon and evening at all with temperatures in the 90s across the state and mostly clear across rest of Texas too, except a few partly cloudy skies out over the west. The good news in the tropics, Fiona continuing to work on off to the northwest. Don't think this will be any threat at all to the eastern or maybe the eastern seaboard, but not to Florida. So that's good news for Florida. Should continue working on up to the northwest. Still encountering some shear, but that shear expected to decrease and this could become a hurricane uh, in the next two to three days as it approaches the Bahamas. Still got a still got a battle ahead of it over Hispaniola and portions of the Dominican Republic. But once it gets into the southeast Bahamas as we head into early next week, this could become a hurricane. But the good news is it's turning north and eventually away from Florida. So that's great news and you can see the trough that's going to pick it up. See the dip in the jet stream here of high pressure over us next week high pressure way out in the Atlantic. There's the weakness picks it right on up. Great shape. That's what you want to see late in the summer as you head into uh, early fall. So that's great news throughout the night tonight. We'll drop on into the 70s. No rain expected across southeast Texas tonight or tomorrow morning, maybe along the coast and offshore early tomorrow morning. That's about it. Notice not as cool tonight. We'll still drop on down into the upper 60s near 70 in the lakes lower 70s here in the triangle will warm right back up into the uh, lower 90s coming up for Saturday with about a 10 to 20% coverage showers and storms in the forecast for your Saturday as we head into next week be less than that marine forecast sees two to three feet not bad water temperature 84 degrees becoming mostly clear tonight lows near 70 lakes low 70s triangle and for your Saturday warm and humid slight chance of a shower mainly near the coast Otherwise, pretty warm, low 90s next week. Actually, the beginning of fall is next Thursday, but well, it's not going to feel like it here. <laughs> oh, my goodness. You know, the only consolation, I guess, is that we had such a nice week this week. We with did. Below normal. Next week, we can pay. But Above normal. <laughs> yeah, my goodness. Mid 90s. Mid 90s. No rain next week. But, uh, hey, at least it's protecting us from the tropics. So, bingo. That's good. <laughs> All right. 409 Sports.